Hi there guys, um, just want to do a quick video, it's not, a, it's not a long video, it's just a quick one, just to get you guys thinking um, with this lockdown business. Everything's been so strange lately, um, it all, to me, it all points towards the government wants to take control of our lives. Um, with the tier one, tier two, tier three, tier four, when does it stop? Does it stop at the point where they've got enough tier to say, right, we've got full control of your life, um, and that's it? Um, I think they're using this coronavirus as just a really, really, how can I put it? A poor excuse. The reason why it's such a poor excuse is because we can think, think for ourselves, which um, a lot of you know, wearing these masks over our face doesn't actually work, but we wear it. We comply to what the government's telling us. And that is a frightening thing because that is the first stage of the government is controlling us, telling us what to do. I mean, if the mask was so successful keeping the virus away or keeping us spreading virus the lab people would be wearing it don't you think so what i'm trying to say is think for yourself there's nothing seems to be right with what's going on um with what the government's telling us one minute they're telling us the school will stay open next minute they're telling us oh no this new strain of virus is more susceptible to kids where now where does it stop where does it actually stop for us to think new strain of virus is there actually a new strain of virus or is this just what the government is telling us because it's easier to manipulate us through fear of a new strain of virus now think for yourself guys and girls what is the best way to control that some somebody it's through fear and the government is using the covid just a big thing because everyone is so scared of the COVID. Oh, COVID might kill us. COVID might kill my family if I take my family out. Well, I'm sorry, the mainstream media don't actually tell you that this family of eight, they all had COVID, but they all not shown any signs and any symptoms of the COVID, but they all fine. The mainstream media don't report that. Why? It's because they want to scare us. And if we even know that COVID is not as, you know, doesn't kill everyone, we are going to be so less to comply with what they are telling us to do, like wearing the mask, you must wear a mask. Well, I'm sorry. Everyone's saying, I can't wait till we get back to normal. The truth is, while you are wearing the mask, you'll never get back to normal. So, you know, wearing the mask is up to you, but I know it's not for me. And also, I'm not, I'm not an anti-mask wearer. I'm just using my own, you know, my own noodle to say, right, okay, this mask doesn't actually work because if it works, the lab people would be wearing it. I'm just using my own common sense on everything with what's going on. And my common sense tells me nothing adds up other than the government is trying to use this to control us. And when does it stop? We don't know. You know, how do we know next week is not going to be an extra tier? Because we're not complying. This is just a small exercise. I think this is just a small exercise for the government to say, right, we'll try this to see whether we can control these people by using this virus. Now, if they comply, that's quite easily to say, yes, we can manipulate people to be controlled. But there we are. We're walking around like sheep, wearing masks. And as long as you are wearing the mask, life will never be normal. You, you wear that mask when you're out. Do you feel normal? No, of course you don't. But as soon as you take that mask off, do you feel normal? Of course you do. You can walk around quite freely, do your own thing. And we are not born to breathe carbon dioxide because that's what the mask is doing. When you wear that mask and we talk to people for a long period of time, you get headaches, that's the first sign. You get, you get your body get warm, your body temperature will get warm. And secondly, you'll get headaches and so on. We were not 
born to breathe carbon dioxide and wearing a mask you are breathing your own carbon dioxide well I'm just putting that out there guys and girls think about it think for yourself you know there's a bigger picture think outside the box and I'm gonna sign off for now and maybe I'll do another video thank you watch and subscribe